okay? He's just laying on the ground. What's going on? Please, somebody help him. Ha, 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 ha. Staying alive. Staying alive. Oh, oh, oh. All right, let's learn how to give CPR. Welcome to the CPR simulator on Oculus Quest 2. This is the certified nurse who's going to walk us through the process. I'm actually really excited because I don't remember the last time when I was taught how to perform CPR and I think this is a, such an important skill for anyone. You never know when you will need to save a life. And here in VR is the perfect setting for us to do it. So let's go. So this is a beta version of the app and uh, there's going to be many more different scenarios in this game. But for now, we will just be in a city hall park scenario. And here it is, this is the city hall. It looks really nice, really pretty city hall, but something terrible will happen soon and we'll need to save somebody's life. We'll even give you the description. All right, on your way home from your work, you go through a city park. Here you find a man who seems unconscious laying on the ground or no. You decide to help him by calling for help and perform CPR until the ambulance shows up. Yes, let's do this. Oh no, oh no, dude, are you okay? He's just laying on the ground. What's going on? Please somebody help him. Are you all right? We're gonna have to call for him and see if he's all right. Sir, are you all right? Do you need help? Of course, he's not responding. We gotta save him. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh dude, you don't look good. Hey, are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? <laughs> this is not, he's not sleeping. Why would he sleeping in the park? All right, we gotta shake him. We gotta shake him good. Are you sleeping? Are you okay? Answer. <laughs> of course he's not answering. All right, so please, you're a nurse. Help him, save him. I don't know how to do that. <sighs> Useless. She's just going to give us some advice. Tell his head back, clear path for the airways with two fingers like this. All right, is he breathing? I don't hear him breathing at all, no. He's not breathing. This is terrible, dude. Oh, and throughout the game, they're going to quiz you on some of the knowledge of this uh, situation. What are you going to do? I'm going to call 911. Oh, and here, my phone is right here. That's a pretty good phone. 911. I really can't believe that I have to wait this long for 911 to pick up. I never really had to call it, but if this how long it takes to pick up, then this is terrible. No, you need to get here right away. Oh, okay. So now you have to explain where you are, what happened, and when. All right. I'm going to let you pass through this quiz and see how well you will do it at uh, explaining what happened. You can see an AED. How can you see it? You're on my phone. Oh, all right. Well, I guess here's AED. Let's go there. I'm very curious if there are AEDs in the US just standing for free in the city parks. I've never seen one like that, but that would be cool. All right, let's go save his life. Okay, what do we do next? To use this thing, it needs direct contact with the person's skin. So, sorry my friend, but I will need to vandalize your t-shirt for a little bit. Okay, whoa, they make it really realistic. He's got some belly, he has some chest hair. It's pretty, yeah, pretty realistic, I would say. So we can open this lid, remove it, and start. Device check. Stay calm. I'm calm. Check Don't tell me to stay calm. Attach defib pads to the patient's bare chest. Oh, okay. Okay, so we're going to attach this. Oh, all right. I've never had to do this before. This is pretty freaky. Okay, so I put this to his chest. Then I'll unpeeling I'm peeling this sticker, you just put the sticker over here and wrap it all like that. And another one, sticker, unwrap it one more time. Okay, it's ready. <laughs> now this is it, the moment we will be waiting for, I'm going to do the CPR. So you have to put the right position on your hands and do the correct beat per minute to the song. They're going to play a song. Staying alive, staying alive. Stay oh, come on. All right, we gotta, we gotta maintain it. No. All right. Here you go. It's in the green zone. Green zone. Oh. oh, oh. Do not touch patient. I'm not touching him. I hope I saved him. Did I save him? Analyzing. Please, please breathe. Shock advised. <gasps> no. Press shock button. Shock? Ah, oh, uh, I'm not going to do that thing. It's just going to shock him on its own. Okay. Good luck, buddy. Oh, ah! 
Oh God! <gasps> yes, yes, yes! He's alive! You're breathing! You're alive! I saved him! You didn't help! Yay! Woo! He's gotta be alright! But when the shocking part was really freaky because he like... Oh, this is much freakier than just practicing on a doll, I'll tell you that. We did it, friends! We saved him and he is standing! Look at him! He's alive, he's well, he's even smiling a little bit. You're welcome, mister! Just be careful next time! <laughs> this was really exhilarating in a way because, yeah, there is a man laying right in front of you. This is much more stressful than just practicing on a doll without arms and without legs. And in the end, this game gives you the statistics of how you did the quiz questions, your answers, and actually the rhythm that you gave, like whether you could maintain the good rhythm, which is really good. You can go back and look at all the questions. I'm really uh, impressed by this game and it can be even better. I hope that in the future, the developers will consider providing more freedom for the user so that they're not just following the predetermined course of actions, but maybe they have more freedom to do what they think they should be doing and then compare it to the correct course of actions. But this is amazing. I'm so glad that games like these are being developed, it's not just for entertainment, it's for education, for learning a really important skill, CPR. Looking forward to seeing future iterations and thank you the team for providing me the free copy of the game for me to try. I really, really enjoyed it. And this is great work. I hope to see it developing. And guys, if you want to see more exciting VR reviews and gameplays, please subscribe to Disco VR. I'll be super happy if you do. Thank you so much for watching, friends. Stay safe and as always, happy gaming.